Good day people, welcome back to my YouTube channel, the Elliott Wave Principle. I'm your host, Shaheen. Now, in yesterday's price movement, I uh, discussed my some of my trading, and this is the trading that I have closed uh, those trades today. And the major region is because there's the possibility that we are actually coming to the major resistance, and right now we are seeing that the resistance is uh, coming in, in handy. Uh, the resistance I'm talking about is of a triangle that you're expecting to complete right over here. So, of course, the line is not visible. I'm not showing the analysis here. We were expecting that this is a triangle. Uh, right now, we can see that the price of uh, gold is, is kind of reluctant to go through that area. And that is the reason that I have closed my trades on gold and silver. What is expected to happen after that? I'm going to discuss that into my analysis on uh, Patreon.com. If you guys are interested in seeing what exactly is uh, is uh, the next step I'm looking at it uh, then either we can see that the price will be coming in this region and then go up uh, then the next support is in this region and then go up and the next sto stage is uh, somewhere in this region and then go up uh, now if you are trading Elliott wave analysis if you're trading if you are a retail trader this is about a $100 uh, range and it's a very very important range in my uh, pet analysis on patreon I'll be discussing the reasons why I'm favoring one of those analysis on a larger time frame if you do not want to spend money on uh, on my analysis on a larger time frame I'm looking that we are completing wave 3 right over here and we will be completing wave 4 right over here and I'm expecting for the price of gold to create an extended uh, trend beyond the triangle and I think like that should at least easily take it from anything from beyond $2,500. So I'm expecting a larger price movement in gold and I'm expecting a, a larger price movement uh, happening in silver at least for the next couple of years. Uh, it, this could easily take prices of gold uh, to somewhere around $4,000 an ounce and in silver we could easily look for the prices to first go to $50 and then probably push back to $100 an ounce on silver. Um, so you know, on a smaller time frame uh, I'm what I'm expecting and why I'm expecting I'm going to discuss this is very very interesting price behavior and it's not only because of the resistance I'll give some important reasons on my patreon page and uh, that why I have decided to pull out of the condition and why I have even decided to reverse the position as well so I've reversed the position now I was expecting for the pri price to actually pass through it but now the price is not actually passing through it uh, so I'm discussing all this on my patreon page which is patreon.com forward slash Elliot wave green uh, wish to see you guys down there have a good one and bye bye